Okay, so you and your potential magic heart love each take a strip of paper and each twist and tape your strip of paper into a twisted loop. Or if you don't have your potential magic heart love person in the same room, you can just think their vibes and twist the loop for them. So you've got your two loops. Now you tape them or glue them together just at one spot so the strips are attached 90 degrees from each other. And now you are ready to test your love with scissors. Carefully cut along the center of each loop, all the way around one and then all the way down the center of the other. If your love is destined by topology, your two loops will turn into two linked hearts. But if the forces of mathematics refuse to link you to each other, well, love isn't always all about fate. Sometimes it's about cooperation and effort. So see if you can figure out what to change to make it work. Either that or use a fourth dimension. And that's it. I learned this trick from Mike Caputo, who published it in the January 1990 edition of the Oregon Mathematics Teacher, but I can't find the article anymore, so I'm just going by what I wrote when I blogged about this 11 years ago, so let me know if you have more info. Happy Valentine's Day, you wonderful magic love person, you. Pi Day is only one month away, and I've been working really hard on that video, but I wanted to say hi in the meantime, so see you on March 14th. Be there or be not a circle. Okay, love you, bye.